swipe them visas. Totally cool, Dad. Hey guys, it's Sharice. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how I do this hairstyle. Um, it's very easy. Well, basically, one, two, three. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys how I do my short passion twists. Um, they are very easy, like I said. And the hardest part is parting it. And I definitely had this hair set for a while, so I just really just showed you how to redo it. Oh, blah, blah. But yeah, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll have all my social medias in the description box below. So thank you again, and let's begin. Okay, so I believe I had 20 to 24 like sections in my hair. I don't really remember, but what I used to hold it down was um, Gorilla Snot, and I also use Jam. And I obviously use a rat tail comb to part it. You guys do not have to part it perfectly, cause I didn't, but um, just freestyle. It don't have to be perfect. And also, right now I'm showing you that I use rubber bands and I also put oil on my, on my rubber bands just to prevent breakage. And obviously clips, edge control, and the hair that I use with Lulu Tris. So it's been like a week with these in my hair. I actually like how they look. I like my real hair, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like if my real hair was this long, nobody could tell me shit. But, oh my God, I forgot my mole. So, I did cut these before I put them in my head. I cut them in a half and I just twist them. And that's how they came out. Um, I'm going to show you how to do it. Um, first, what you could, what I did, I used a crochet needle. And I push it through. So, I have my crochet needle, and I'm going to take this out so I can really show you guys how it's done, and then I'm just going to show you me redoing the ones I got a little, you know, fluffy, or my hair is kind of like, you know, not property. Even though I kind of like the look, because it makes my hair, like a, like my hair is actually in a twist out. But anyway, I still you see my parts that I showed you guys in the previous clips. Oh, let me put it up. This is how it look. I'm not gonna lie, I haven't really been greasing my scalp. So that's pretty good. But, um, so this is how the hair look after I cut it in half. So I put it, I push, it has to be closed, as you can see. Cause you don't want it to open up. Push it in close. Get the hair. Put the hair on the hook. And then pull it through. Then pull one side. And then I put jam. I want the hair because I don't want the hair to be noticeable. I don't put that much because I still want it to look natural. I still want my hair to kind of puff up. <laughs> like I want it to look like I actually twist my real hair. So I put a little bit on it. Because remember I blow dried my hair so it's manageable. So. I just start to twist. Okay, this is my left. So I start twisting to the left. Twist. Sometimes if the hair do like spin around and don't like the twist and that means you are supposed to twist it the other way. <laughs> I 
and get your rubber bands and tie it. I use little tress. I use two and a half packs water wave 18 inches and you see there's like I cut it in between there and then I use one side to twist if that makes sense so I'll show you what that means so there there's two sides I cut this side and then I bend it like that and the one side that I cut I bend it and then that's when I started twisting it. So I basically, this would be the part that you will hook. So since I cut them in half, you will only need two and a half packs. And I'm gonna redo this one as well. I'm not gonna take it out, I'm just gonna retwist it. I think with this side, I'm gonna twist to my right. I'm kind of trying to stretch this hairstyle, so that's why I am redoing it because I don't feel like one putting on a wig which is gonna come off in like two or three days. And I don't feel like doing my hair. This is a perfect, perfect hairstyle. So this is how they're going to look. See, it like twist. And I do the rubber band method with this hairstyle because it's, I, when I tried braiding it, it didn't work for me. I'm gonna redo these. And these. <laughs> look how crazy they look. I don't really care that much about the back, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Cause ain't nobody looking for real. I thought I was recording. So I'm gonna show you again. I put jam on my hair, put the crochet needle through, closed, put the hair on the hook and pull. I guess I didn't do it right, wait, hold on. Close, push, Put it on the hook, pull. Oh God, now my hair. Okay, okay. You see the little end? You hold one side and pull it through the hole to make it more tight. Pull it and size twists on the left. Also, you can make sure when you pull it through, it's even. I'll put a rubber band over it. I mean, around it, not on it. I don't fucking. You know what I mean. Um. This hairstyle do not take a long time. I think the longest um, part is parting it. <laughs> That's the longest part. But actually putting it in and twisting it does not take that long. And again, I cut the hair in half, which means, cause the hair I use is little tress. Cause I feel like it makes it like little tress. Let me show you the package. This one I had to wrap it to the right 
because when I wrapped it on the left, it didn't look like a twist. So that's what I'm saying. Sometimes you gotta wrap it to the left, sometimes you gotta wrap it to the right. Everything you want, baby. Okay, so now that I've finished retwisting the front, I'm gonna show you guys how I like to wear it. I like to wear it up like this to frame my hair, like half up, half down, with a little frame in the front. I should redo the back, but I don't feel like it. Or <laughs> I wear it all the way up, which I'm gonna wear it today, all the way up. In a ponytail. Like that. Very easy. You know, I don't have to complain, don't have to worry. Um I'm gonna do my edges, cover my edges since I have this here, so don't blame me, don't judge me. So I know some of you guys can see the rubber bands, but rubber bands do not bother me because it really look natural to me. So I'm gonna use, ooh, Style Factor Edge Control. This one is in green, extra shine haul, I guess, that's what it's called. I'm gonna put it on my edges. <laughs> This is the final look. Thank you guys for watching. Hope your video is very informative and fast enough for you to learn. And yeah. Thank you for watching and bye.